What do you reckon about this? This is a scribbly gum, Eucalyptus hemostoma, and it's hollow in the middle. Uh, this is a very wide trunk. The tree could easily be a thousand years old. Uh, what happens is that they get a bit of sort of fungus disease in the wood, then the termites move in and hollow it out a fair bit. Then you get a bushfire and the whole thing becomes a chimney and it burns the whole middle of the tree out. You could say the heart and the soul of the tree is gone and it's going to die. They don't. What happens is with all the hollow logs and all the bits and pieces, possums and birds that nest in these things move in and they make it their home and of course they bring food with them in their bellies from far and wide and do their poo around the place which of course gives you fertilizer for the gum tree remember a pipe is almost as strong as a bar in other words a tree that is hollow as long as it's mostly intact on the outside is pretty safe it's not likely to fall over so there you are this weird sculpture living sculpture hundreds and hundreds of years old is still quite solid and I can sit here reasonably safely on the inside. And the amazing thing about this tree is that the timber on it is only about that thick. It's very, very thin all the way through and been here hundreds and hundreds of years. What a wonderful thing. Well, what a privilege to be able to live with something like this.